coming through with my whole team, they coming too, that's real, too real, motherfucker tell me how you feel, I'm too good for my own good, I won't leak the album, I let it spill, number one bitch, I bet it will, do the numbers, I said it Yo, 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 what's up, it's your boy Fat Dollars, aka Mr. 1000, bringing you another Madden 18 update. Today we're going to talk about the Madden 18 wide receiver ratings. We're going to go over the top five, and I would like to know in the comment section who do y'all think y'all top five would be, how would y'all list be made, let me know all that good stuff. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, right after you hit that subscribe button, hit the notification button right next to it. Drop a like if you're not a hater. Let's get on with the rest of the video. I got some Madden 17 games. Gameplay playing in the background a game that I played a little earlier so and it's gonna show you if you pay attention to the gameplay it's gonna show you some things that need to be switched in Madden 18 people making bad reads getting bailed out throwing it in double coverage not getting the interception all that type of good stuff but in the number one position we got Julio Jones 98 overall from the Atlanta Falcons when teams draft a wide receiver in the first round, they want that receiver to basically be a Julio Jones. Defensive coordinators lose sleep over stopping Julio. His combination of size, speed, and strength are difficult to match. Kind of like Kelvin Johnson, Megatron was. Jones scores a 94 speed, 98 catch, 91 juke, and has 84 on the spin move and stiff arm. Few in the game ever have even been better than Julio Jones. Coming in the number two spot, we got Antonio Brown. Now, he's been a stud for the past four or five years, man. So, he comes in at a 97 overall. He has 98 awareness, 92 speed, 93 acceleration, 98 agility, meaning he'll be able to shift, get the top speed real, real fast, and he got 54 strength. Pittsburgh Steelers, in terms of Madden ratings, there's Jones and Brown, and then there's everyone else. So basically, these two are in a league of their own. There are other great receivers, but these two are the top. Brown falls behind Jones in some of the intangibles, but makes up that ground elsewhere, combining 98 agility, 98 catch, and 97 elusiveness. Both his elusiveness score and ball carrier vision, which is a 98, are the highest among wide receivers. Let's throw in a 97 juke move, 88 spin, and 93 kick return, just for the fun of it. Coming in at number 3, we got A.J. Green. He's been making a mark in the league over the past couple years. He comes in at a 94 overall. He got 95 awareness, 91 speed, 90 acceleration, 94 agility, and 72 strength. So he can block some cornerbacks and seal the edge for you. He's from the Cincinnati Bengals. It should be a testament to how good wide receivers are in the NFL that somebody as talented as A.J. Green is a number three. Only slightly slower than the two guys rated above him, Green carries a 91 speed, 94 agility, and 97 jump. 97 out of 100 jumping. Woo! That boy can get up and get some of them balls. Green is big too, standing at six foot four. At this point, you can just lob it up to AJ Green. Ignore coverage completely and still have some success. Coming in at number four, the guy that invented aggressive catches in Madden. Oh. BJ coming in at a 93 overall, 94 awareness, 94 speed, 94 acceleration, 97 agility, and only 49 strength. New York Giants. As a rookie in 2014, OBJ became the darling of every sports highlight reel mates made since that point. It's clear the Madden ratings guys haven't forgotten and have blessed OBJ with a 99 spectacular catch rating. He also matches Julio's speed and nearly matches Brown's agility. He may not be as big as the other guys on this list, but he doesn't need to be. Even his kick return is decent for a desperate time scenario. Coming in at number five, Dez Brand. 91 overall a lot of people say he is overrated y'all let me know in the comment section what do y'all feel about this list Des Bryant Dallas Cowboys 92 awareness 89 speed kind of on the low side 91 acceleration but he can get to his uh, top speed faster his acceleration is higher than his speed he got 89 agility 76 strength the Cowboys X Factor rounds out at top five He's the slowest out of the other four wide receivers, but still very effective with 89 speed. This is paired with a 97 in both spectacular catch and catch in traffic. Just like in the NFL, Bryant is a reliable target even when covered. But everybody know Dez Bryant dropped it. 
And then we got the honorable mentions list, who is DeAndre Hopkins, 91, Jordy Nelson, 91, Mike Evans, 90, Larry Fitzgerald, 90, and they make up the rest of the 90 group. And then we got everything else, 89 and below. So y'all let me know. Who is y'all top picks? What order would y'all have it in? Some of y'all might want to throw in uh, Brandon Marshall, DeAndre Hopkins, Mike Evans in y'all top. Let me know in the comment section. If you're new, hit that like button. Subscribe. Shout out to all the new subscribers. Let's get it.